Oh, hey, how are you? It's time to start our eBay breaks. We're going to go ahead and do 2015 Prism Football Hobby number 16. And as always, good luck, everybody. Well, ninjas, I literally, I literally just broke a case of Bowman Jumbo. Uh, next week, we have a baseball product coming out called Tier 1 on Wednesday. And we'll likely have a PYT up of that by Sunday, maybe Monday the latest. You know, we got to look at the checklist and blah, 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 you know, steal prices, you know. Make sure our prices look better than everybody else's. You know the deal. You know how it is. What would you? What, what should you get from Taco Bell that won't make you feel like doo doo? Uh, nothing, because everything will make you feel like that at Taco Bell. Richard, I had to like, well, I didn't do it, but Jason, I guess he restarted the computer and everything. So long story short, I just didn't do it today. But you seem, you seem to like it. There's a, pot a potato fiesta bowl. Well, listen, first of all, you can't go wrong with the Baja Mountain Dew. Oh, no, no, he means the eBay ticker, Tomas. He means the eBay ticker. Dame la cabeza. Do you, know, do you even know what you're saying right now? A girly, says Jeff. Yes, sir. It is nice to know in the break. Yeah, you're right. You're right. I shall do that moving forward. I'm going to like save a little. I'll do some magic here on my end. Whole lot of packs to open here. CBJ calls who? Pappy Poppy? <laughs> Does he really? <laughs> that's that's actually kind of funny. Uh, right now, I'm opening 2015 Prism Football number 16, Silverman. Exactly. That's well. That well. He wishes he was that cool, Jeff. Oh, see, see. I'm very intrigued. What? What? Some prison football. Prison football. Hells yeah. What are you looking for? We're looking for top girlies in this thing. Amari Cooper in this thing. Marcus Mariota. We're looking for Darren Sharper. Darren Sharper, the hardest hitting safety in the league, though? I don't think he was a rookie in 2015. Darren Sharper. 
the hottest hit safety in the league, though. Bo D, that's Mario. That's, that's my boy. That's my, that's my teammate, my quarterback. Well, he's he he left, Tomas. He's 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 back on the stream over there. Uh, Silverman, I would say hit up Taco Bell and the Tinder Freak. Put the team on my back. Broke his leg and he's still out there, dog. Putting the team on his back, dope. There you go, Jeff. Well, I, I'm in Florida. I know people. And you know what I'm doing when I'm done with this. Eric is doing step one. F Taco Bell. <laughs> uh, Taco Bell is cool. If as long as you don't eat it like on the regular, I think. Like if you have Taco Bell like once a month, you know, it'll it'll taste great, and then you know you have enough time to forget about the terrible aftertaste, and then the murder scene in your bathroom afterward. Am I gonna go to the swamp and catch a python? Why? When I got one in my pants, you know. Uh, Taco Bell is great for farts and the mud butt. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. I still got packs to open here. You know, you know what slept on is Chipotle. Chipotle is pretty fire. If you're still in South Florida, you'd be. Oh, you can't go wrong with that Cuban party, dog. Cuban food for the lean. So, Eric, what made you want to leave South Florida aside from the people? And the insane cost to live here. A pants party? You know what's funny? I was watching Harold and Kumar uh, Part 2. It's on It's on Netflix, by the way, for all my, uh, for all my peeps that partake. And you know what's up. Uh, so, yeah, it's Harold and Kumar Part 2. They don't go to White Castle. I think they went to Guantanamo Bay. Oh, damn, Eric will wait to bum me out super quick. Sorry to hear that, man. I think so, Jeff. I think so, too. You know, instead of, you know, just like you go to the store to go get that 12-pack, I'm going to go to the store to go, to go get me that, that half O. Oh, he beat it? Oh, awesome. Oh, fuck yeah. I'm about to say, Eric, you, you about to bum me out, dog, because, you know, my mom had cancer, my dad had cancer, and uh, that C word just, you know. I am. I look, Bodine, I'm looking. You want attention? I'm looking, bro. Jesus Christ. So high maintenance. God. You're like a girl. But worse, you're like a girl named James. Oh, yeah? Am I supposed to be impressed? What up, uh, rolling on my floor gas gasms? I appreciate that, Eric. I appreciate that. No, Baldin, you are you are gorgeous. You're a gorgeous woman named James. I don't even know where Fort Walton Beach is. Do I like Cuban girls? Hell yeah. What? I'm currently in love with this one chick that I met at a bar and went with Yard. 
she's half Cuban, half Puerto Rican. Oh my God. That's all I got to say about that. What's up, uh, Gasms? How you? How, how the Gasms treating you? You know, I had a couple earlier today. It's okay, Emerald City. It's okay. We talked about this already. You know, the, the key to comedy is you can't give up. You got to keep trying. And you can't be afraid to, to put yourself out there a little bit. Exactly, Gasms, as they should be. By myself, Bodine, that's the best way. Can't nobody do me like I do me. You know what I'm saying? Well, Tomas, I mean, it is eBay time. So, maybe that's why. Eat stone crabs at Catfish Dewey's in Oakland Park. Oh, damn. It's too bad I don't like seafood. I know where... Okay, I know Destin. Damn, you... They, they told me to never go go out there th that way. There are certain parts of Florida that you should just stay away from. I feel like I'm in a library dur during other people's breaks. Always good times here. Well, duh! You know, Uncle Jesse gonna make it live. Well, yeah, Tomas, I mean, I don't know. I guess we just, we got some characters today. We got some characters today. Oh, ribs. Now you're talking my language, Eric. And tomorrow's Thursday? She. Uh, but, see, I got to be in the office, though. Uh, there's only four eBay breaks tonight, unfortunately, Richard. Uh, I should be doing Tier 1 baseball right now. But uh, in case you didn't know or you just ignored me, uh, Tier 1 baseball got pushed back for next week. The 23rd. So, I'm only doing four eBay breaks today. Flanagan's is I uh, Like, Flanagan's is I uh, Like, Flanagan's is, is cool if you go during happy hour. And if you know the bartender. Really, Emerald City? Well, that sucks. Well, that's one thing you don't have to worry about here is that. I made a very innocent joke. Well, what's the joke? Because I want to hear it. I'll let you know if it's innocent or not. Oh, Wing House and Durrell is pretty fire. Flanagan's is, like I said, Flanagan's is nice during happy hour. And if you just have nowhere to go. Flanagan's is cool. Oh, and they also let you keep this cool cup. A little plug here. Like, that's pretty fire. I've actually never had seafood at Flanagan's. I, I don't eat seafood, period. Yeah, I, d I did pull a Pele autograph out of that World Cup prison box of many moons ago. But the truth is, Noah, we just don't have that many people interested in, in soccer. So that's why we don't rip that that often. But yeah, I mean, we like I said, Noah, check our website. Matter of fact, since... Uh, 
you probably haven't done it I'm gonna do it boom check that link out and get into some full case action baby one box yeah that's cute that's adorable let's do a full case that guy on cup looks like he's dropping the deuce what guy on the cup like what what, what are you seeing Bodine what drugs are you on right now Most of all, the other places ban real people. No idea what you're talking about. Then they go down the drain. Oh, I think you mean like breaking operations? That guy on cup looks like he's taking a shit. The guy on cup. You mean this guy? Don't do. Don't you dare talk about Mr. Flanagan. Dude, read my shit, man. Red. Laugh out loud. Okay, are you done? Okay. Really, Noah? That's what you're going to complain about? Really? 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 That's what you're going to complain? I usually get the opposite complaint, but that's what you're going to complain about? Done. Maybe because they're not in the World Cup, Noah? Maybe because their checklist is not the greatest, Noah? I mean, God. There's a... God. You just can't please people, I swear. Uh, AJ Green to 25, Bengals. Well, good, Noah. Good. I hope I hope you learned your lesson. All that money you're saving. Uh, especially my sa sarcasm will get you everywhere. Especially my cornhole. Hmm. Hmm. Are you happy, Bodine? You sick freak. What do we have here? Auto to 75. Green cracked eyes. Marcus Murphy. Saints. Well, you got to look at the checklist, Noah. You got to look at the checklist. And if Italy was so good, how come they didn't qualify for the World Cup? Hmm. Hmm. A JJ Green Dolphins. Vincent Jackson Bucks Green. I don't have the checklist, but if you were to Google the checklist, I'm pretty sure you can find it. Have you heard of Google, uh, Noah? It's it's a Pretty uh, game changing deal. Uh, the US did not make it because they suck at soccer. They always have and they probably always will. It's that simple. We call this football. And you think we're going to qualify for a World Cup? GTFO. Our American Soccer League is a joke. We should be banned from soccer. I want to say that. I've, I've been saying it for a while that the USA should be banned from playing soccer. Because if we ever won a World Cup, it'd be like World War Four. Calvin Johnson Lions to Fitty. But yeah, our soccer team is a joke. Like, the women's are great. The, the women's side is the best in the world. But the men's side is an absolute joke. Brian Bennett Colts blue. I mean, the MLS is starting to get a little bit better. You know, they're they're getting a little bit better here and there. But it's it's I don't know, man. I, I really th you know what it is. It's the f I just soccer is just not a big deal in the states. It's just not. Am I saying that? Uh, yes, no. That's exactly what I'm saying. No, you know, I'll take it a step further. Bro, they couldn't even beat Costa Ricans. They couldn't even beat Panama or Nicaragua. They, Bro, they couldn't even qualify in the worst conference in the world. What's what's that? Con like, I don't even know the conference name. What is it? The CONCACAF or the Coma Bowl? It's the worst in the world. Like, come on, we, come on man. Now, the women on the other side, I'm just in love with them. Uh, Cordero Patterson, Vikings Red. Mm, well, maybe on FIFA, Noah. Maybe on FIFA, but, but not in real life. 
Uh, James Bodine, don't tell me how to live my life. Go sit on your hands or something. Uh, Vincent Jackson, blue for the books. Pierre Garçon, Redskins, blue wave. That's the 150. I just feel very strongly about soccer. It's one of my favorite sports. And it's an absolute joke in the States. And it's, it's aggravating. It's the world's most popular sport. And we're terrible at it. Exactly, Emerald City, you know? Like, all the big players come to the MLS to retire and, and collect more paychecks and just chill. Uh, Martavis Bryant, Steelers, red. Noah, whatever you're smoking, dog, send me some of that, dog. Because I, I want some. I want some. All right, there goes the first box. Two autos per box. Need some big time rookies here. I tell, bro, I'll tell you what, Noah. I'll take it this far. You could get all of the best American players, and they couldn't even beat the Tijuana Cholos. You get the best USA players, and they couldn't even beat a Mexican team. Matt Forte Bears to 75. Bro, the men's team couldn't beat the women's team. Let's start there. The men's team could not beat the women's team. It's a they're they're an absolute joke. If they were so good, tell me how they couldn't why couldn't they qualify? Why couldn't they qualify? <laughs> it's that simple. If they if they were really good, they would have qualified for a World Cup. It's only it only takes four years for you to qualify. It only takes four years. They're a joke. Dante Fowler, Jags, to 150. Uh, you got me all razzle-dazzled, Noah. I'm just going to ignore you for, for the rest of this break here. You got me knocking over cameras. I'll take it. I've seen their jerseys. They're pretty hard. Just make sure it says Moses on the back. Um, that XL, dog. You already know. Bodine, sit on your thumb and spin. Uh, J.J. Nelson, Cardinals autograph. But yes, the men's the men's national soccer team is an absolute joke. Absolute joke. Brandon Cook, Saints Blue. Wow, that's fun. <laughs> there you go, Bodine. <laughs> you got you saw the Chicago Fire play? Sorry to hear that, Ninja. Go to a Real you know, if Real Madrid or Bayern Munich or Chelsea or Barcelona or Ju or Juventus or Inter Milan or or, or you know Paris Saint Germain if any of those teams are ever in town, I highly suggest you watch that game, Ninja, so you can actually watch some real soccer. I mean, football. What do we have here? We got Taylor Heineke, Vikings Auto. The, U, the MLS is on par with the English Second Division League. Man, I don't. Need, I w that's 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 high praise for the for the MLS right there, Eric. That is some high praise for the for the MLS. JJ Red Dolphins. Barry Sanders Green Lions. The most exciting thing in soccer is when they kick the ball. Yes. Yes, it is. I also take a shot every time somebody flops. And, you know, I just get really wasted. Trent Richardson, Raiders, Red. Oh, dude, there's so many teams I didn't mention. Manchester United, Liverpool, Arsenal, Tottenham. Like, man. There's, oh, God. Well, no, I love you. I love you, Noah. Nick 
Well, Emerald City, I'm telling you, man, there's there's nothing like going to a soccer game. I will say this about the Seattle Sanders, uh, the Seattle Sounders. They have a really, really great so like soccer stadium and environment. Like, if the rest of the MLS was like Seattle, who knows? Uh, Barry Sanders' line's blue. And, you know, there's there's ways to improve the MLS, man. You know, have like a first division and a second division. Have like a Premier League, a Champions League. You know, imitate what they're doing overseas. Send some of the talent over overseas. But you know, kids and kids and kids in, in middle school and in high school don't want to play soccer. They rather play baseball or football or basketball or lacrosse. Even they rather be on the bowling team than play soccer. Anyway, season shorts, Texans, two hundred ninety nine. Uh, you signed up, but the promo code didn't even work. Uh, Robert Jennings, uh, where'd you use the code one? Uh, the promo code can only be used on our website, and it does require a minimum purchase of $25, Robert. All jokes aside, though, Ninja, uh, soccer's, dude, soccer's fun, man. I hope you get into it. Devin Smith Jets, that's to 50, although I will highly suggest... Uh, oh, they do have two divisions? Ah, see, I didn't even know that. So they have a first and a second division in MLS? Okay. Really, Robert? I've never heard of... Th I don't know, that's... Send me an email, Robert, because I, I don't know what situation you're, going, you're, you're dealing with. I think you sent me an email earlier. Yeah, you did. Uh, I emailed you back. So just send me an email, Robert, and I uh, and I'll help you out. Cause right now in the chat, I can't can't really help you. I'm kind of busy here. But yeah, man, check your email. Check your email. Cause now I, was, I, I thought it sounded familiar. Marshawn Lynch, green for the Seahawks. Well, Eric, I could I could have predicted that one. It's the MLS. Uh, Rashad Green, Jaguars. Did you guys hear what Zlatan Ibrahimovic had to say about the MLS? That should tell you everything you need to know. Shane Reed at three hundred for the Broncos. One of the greatest footballers ever to breathe oxygen and drink water and kick a ball. Laughed when they tried to compare the MLS. To the Premier League. Or like any other leagues overseas. Alright, there you go Broncos. Uh, Emerald City, you think you just got your first card. What what team do you have in this, in this break? Hey, two-card Arsenal, can you entertain Bodine over there? You know, there's only so much I can do. I'd rather you, you know, we're just going to stop streaming on, on Breakers, Bodine, so you might as well just come to YouTube. Stefan Anthony, Saints Red. Marshawn Lynch, Blue Seahawks. Oh, you luck. Bro, you guys got Whataburger? Oh, man. I wish we had Whataburgers here still. Well, we never had water burgers in South Florida, but we had them in Central Florida. So fire. All right, no, have a good night, man. Oh, of course the Premier League is the best by far. It's not even, it's the Premier League. Mario Williams, Bills, to Still pretty sweet. Short print. Amari Cooper Raiders rookie card with the uh, portrait. Man, I haven't had Whataburger in over 10 years. That was like my go-to back in college. Oh, Amagbe 
Odigizua. Giants blue. To 125, Melvin Gordon, rookie auto for the Chargers. Let's take a card. That is a good card. So you went to Wendy's. Yo, Wendy's is slept on. Wendy's is slept on. They got some. They got a pretty solid menu out there at Wendy's. The only not the only knock I have on Wendy's is they're just not twenty four seven. Like, I at least I haven't come across a twenty four seven Wendy's. Uh, Jordan Taylor Broncos cracked ice. That's the seventy five Broncos. Yeah, Ninja. That's that sounds about that sounds about right. Now imagine now now you're saying that was just a lot of them, but not all of them, right? Imagine it being all of them, and they all chanting, all singing, all jumping, all with drums, all trumpets, vuvuzelas, the entire game. You just don't see that in the states. You just don't. Eric used to live in London for five years. Nice. What made you leave? And how'd you like it? Was it was it? Did you leave because of slag or something? I don't know. Uh, Mike Wallace, Vikings Green. Oh no! I bet the Seattle Sounders games are are lit. There you go, Eric. Do do two for me. Do two for me. For for me. All right. This break is taking longer than it should because I'm here talking to y'all. But I I don't want to ignore you guys. Uh, Tampa Hall Chiefs blue. Oh, your visa wrote ran out. Gotcha. Yeah, I wouldn't mind living in London. In London, London. London might. Uh, take another one, Eric. Take another one. Ronnie Lott, Niners, Blue. Malcolm Floyd, Chargers, Blue Wave. That's the 150, Chargers. Like, I got my, I got the roll up in the whip. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't mind living in London. And I bet the girls out there are... Uh, who, uh, Dan the Man Marino. For the Dolphins. That's the fitty. You can't smoke cigarettes. Oh, gotcha. I got it. I, I'm slow. I'm slow. Emerald, I'm slow. Uh, Taylor Heineke. I think that's like the second Vikings autograph right there so far. Oh, what do you got? Like a bowl or something, Eric? I thought you. I thought you was maybe dabbing or something. I like. I like my flowers, man. I like my flowers. What can I say? Alrighty. Eli Manning. Giants. Green crack dice to seventy-five. Oh, nah. I really gotta go to London. Is it because you're like a foreigner or something? Oh, you got that. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. She got like a gravity vortex, maybe. You got something fancy. You got like a, a little rig set up. You know? Reggie Bush, red for the Niners. Danny Shelton to 100 for the Browns. Auto. Oh, dude, then pff, I need to move to Seattle, apparently, Emerald. I got to move to Seattle. But first, I got to go to London. I got some slags that uh, need some uh, some tuning up. You know what I'm saying? Amir Abdullah Oblongata, red for the Lions. Multi-chamber with the percolator. I see you, pimp. That's that talk. If you get it, you get it. If you don't, good. Ronnie Lott, green for the Niners. 
I gotta tell you, Eric, I prefer I prefer the blunts, man. Like all the rigs and all that shit is cool, but like I prefer the blunts, dog. Uh, Blake Bell Niners to one fifty. See, Emerald City. If you meant to say that as a joke, now that's funny. Cause you know there's some sarcasm in there. You know, there's a little bit of wit. Like you you put some thought into it. I like it. A little bit of research. I like it. But something tells me you're serious, and that makes it even <laughs> makes it even funnier. <laughs> All right, this is box five. If anybody's keeping count, Gronk, blue for the page. You know what, though, Silverman, I gotta say, dog, it's all about them. Uh... Now, I have like a love hate relationship with it, but backwards, dog, backwards, bro. A Philip Dorset. Really, Emerald City. Nice. You you need well, you do need a license for that. Nick Foles Rams. Well, you should have bought. You should have bought the Browns then, Emerald City. I thought you were joking. I mean, not not too many people show love to the to the O lineman. Rashad Perriman Ravens green cracked ice. That is number to seventy five. Is Philip Dorsett Tony Dorsett's kid? Might be. They're both athletic freaks. Denny Shelton kind of looks like uh, like me. See me in the background there. Hmm? No, right. To 150, PJ Williams, Saints Auto. Oh, really, Emerald? Nice. RSO, RSO. You got me there. You got me there, uh, Jeff. Is that some military shit? Randall Cobb, Green Packers. I'm sorry. I'm trying not to curse. I'm sorry. Stephon Diggs, red for the Vikings. Are we in there, Emerald City? I thought I thought I needed like uh, I had to go fake a headache or something at the at the at the clinic. All right, Drew Brees, red for the Saints. James Harrison, Blue Wave Steelers. That's number to 150. Do you actually, do you partake Emerald City? What's an RSO? I'm trying to figure it out. Carlos Williams, Bills, Blue. Ty Montgomery to 150 for the pack. You heard the Packers very interested in Des Bryant. That would be a nice uh, combo. Although I think Des Bryant should probably go to like the Patriots or maybe the Raiders. I think he'd be a, I think he'd be cool with the uh, with the Steelers or maybe even the Chiefs. But Des Bryant in that Packer uniform might look clean AF. Or Des Bryant with Des Bryant with the Eagles would be pretty sweet too. All right, last box here, folks. Good luck, y'all. Uh, Trent Richardson of the Raiders. You remember this guy? To seventy-five. Man, he was great in college. Came to the pros and. <laughs> Kenny, won't you ring my bell? Ring my bell, my bell, ring, 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 ring. Uh, Kitty Bell, Bucks. I, I, uh, I could, I can't help myself sometimes. Uh, Alex Smith, red for the Chiefs. They're gonna put Mahomes out there. 
I don't know about that one. Lamar Cooper, Raiders Red. Girl, you can't be you can't be sending these late night texts, girl. Especially if you ain't gonna do nothing. Russell Wilson, Green Seahawks. I think we should get one more auto out of this box. Devontae Parker. Red for the Dolphins. If this guy could just stay healthy, that'd be great. Uh, ben, I do not. I do not. And I don't even know what product you're talking about. I did, Richard. I did, and, and Carl won it, unfortunately, for you. Ryan Tannehill, Blue Dolphins. But Ben, I have I, I don't even know what 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 break you're talking about. Like what product? Uh, Levante David Bucks Red to ninety nine. All right, Robert, I'll check that when I have an opportunity, bro. An anti football. Yeah, Ben, I, I couldn't tell you, man. Sorry, dude. Leonard Williams, Jets. Blue. That's the 150. Nice. Rookie auto for Todd Gurley. That's a nice card. That's a real nice card. I wish it had some color on it, though. Melvin Gordon portrait short print for the Chargers. And that's likely going to do it for this break. Is it just me or did this break take a long time? Blake Borders red, Jags. And that should do it. Recap time. Autos only. Here we go. Uh, Todd Gurley Rams. Kenny Bell Bucks. Ty Montgomery Packers, P.J. Williams Seats, Denny Shelton Browns, Taylor Heineke Vikings, Melvin Gordon Chargers, Shane Ray Broncos, Tyler Heineke Vikings, J.J. Nelson Cardinals, Vic Beasley Jr. Falcons, and Marcus Murphy of the Saints. Who they? Who they think this break was? This was 2015 Prison Football Hobby number 16 eBay style. That's what it was. Thank you. We'll get it.